Tonight we are kicking off a special series on Alzheimer's awareness. Channel 8 is very proud to be a media sponsor of this weekend's Walk to End Alzheimer's. So each night this week we'll learn a little bit more about the disease. Tonight we feature two sisters. I sat down with them to see what life is like with one of them fighting the disease. At the age of 60, most people are thinking about retirement, but Kathy Martin was preparing to fight a disease that has no cure, Alzheimer's. And then the very next day, Kathy would say, I don't remember what I did yesterday or who I was with. And she would, we suddenly realized she had these big gaps of understanding. It's a type of dementia that causes problems with memory, thinking and behavior. Almost five and a half million Americans have the disease. That doctor realized you couldn't tell him who the president was and... Really? Yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, Kathy was able to get an early diagnosis, giving her a better chance to benefit from treatment and make a plan for the future, including spending as much time as possible with family. Even though I've, I'll probably call her Joey and her Snitsy or something because I won't know them. <laughs> but they know me, that I'm their aunt, and so forth, and then we go from there. Kathy is one of 10 children, and the entire family participates in the Walk to End Alzheimer's to support her. We're Team Cam, and our motto is we're Team Cam, we're going to wham old Alzam. Last year, their family won the Rising Star Award for the biggest year-to-year -year increase in fundraising dollars. Their goal this year is to double the amount again. The money is important for research, but for Kathy, it's about much more. It's important to me because my family has not left me out just because I might have differences. Kathy may have the disease, but the family is facing it together. Again, the walk takes place this Sunday, September 18th at 1 p.m. at Holmes Lake in Lincoln. I'll be out there and seeing the event, so come join us. For more information, visit our website, klkntv.com.